So just another quick and probably temporary video on Retro DJ 2025 because it's not uh, in production release yet. It's still only ac early access builds. And this is now build 8416. That means we've now gotten three early access releases on, on Virtual DJ 2025. So it's still being uh, actively developed and fixed, really. So uh, this is about uh, the sampler because the sampler and the totally uh, re remake of the sampler is, uh, is the most important feature in uh, Virtual DJ 2025. And some people were complaining that the new sampler acted differently than the old sampler. And that is true, that's kind of the idea, but you can also get more and more settings to make it act like the old sampler. So this specific thing was that uh, if you have more than eight samples in a bank, it doesn't go across here. It's not like you get, so we have a lot of, uh, a lot of samples in this bank, but it still only has eight on each. And then it has these pages, so you can still get to the other ones on your pads. But people are complaining that it wasn't default like before. So if you had eight, it would be the same in both sides. And if you had more than eight, then it would go, uh, it would go across. So you could up to 16 and it wanted that back. So there's actually a setting for that. So uh, that have just been added uh, in in one of the early Rexis releases. That was not the first one. So if you search for span, sampler span across decks, set that to yes, then you get Sample 9 to 16 over here. And even if you then go to a different page, like now it's a copy, then you go to uh, another bank and come back, then, uh, then you get it across the decks again. So it remembers that that's what you want, and then it goes to it if needed. And if, of course, if you go to one that only has uh, less eight or less, then it's mirrored just like before. So that's a little thing that I put in, so it's easier to get uh, accustomed to the new Virtual DJ 2025 if you're depending on stuff like this.